And they're calling it the Big Bay Boom. In less than two days, the South Bay power plant will be imploded. You can watch it live right here on 10 News. New at 6 o'clock, 10 News reporter Joe Little reveals the one thing that had to be removed. Otherwise, the implosion would have never worked. It's an impressive sight. A hotel in Texas disappears forever in a matter of seconds. Or a massive sports arena. Wiped off the map for good. We'll get the same show in Chula Vista when the South Bay power plant finally comes down after more than 50 years on the Bayfront. 10 News spoke with San Diego State Construction and Engineering Department head Ken Walsh. Dr. Walsh says an implosion like the one that took down a hospital in Pennsylvania is a lot safer. The alternative would require crews to remove the plant piece by piece. It actually exposes workers to uh, more safety risks because they're at height and in the structure where things can fall on them. And an implosion is cheaper. Because you're using gravity to do all the demolition work instead of having to cut and jackhammer all the pieces. This is the first implosion in the county since the Hotel San Diego was taken down in 2006. Months have gone into planning this implosion. Crews removed more than 24,000 tons of materials to be recycled. Dr. Walsh says crews also had to make sure to remove the plant's seismic reinforcements. A lot of that reinforcement has to come out or else it'll hold the building up even after you blast it. This is how the plant looks from the main viewing area. A Dynergy spokeswoman told 10 News the three towers on the right will fall towards spectators. The one on the far left will fall to the left. They do it with amazing precision. They have to because the plant is surrounded by sensitive habitats. Habitats that will get larger once the power plant finally comes down. In Chula Vista, Joe Little, 10 News. Tune in to 10 News for the power plant's implosion. Saturday morning, we will have live team coverage from Chula Vista from 5 o'clock until 9. And to find the best spot to see the implosion up close, go to our website, 10news.com. Click on the red television button for a map.